Are you okay? Sweetheart, are you okay? Baby, are you okay? Huh? Yes. Are you sure? Fine. You look like there's a problem. There's no problem. I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Are you sure you don't look fine to me? I'm fine. I'm just tired. Is that something you want? I don't want anything. Just take me home. Awesome. Alright, no problem. I'll take you home. That was so close. Classless Sylvester? Who decided to enjoy a woman far above his class? Oh, he's an illiterate from what I know. How come he's, he's so close to the doctor? Oh, what would have happened if he had recognized me? Sylvester, I need you to tell me what really happened in the house and there. What was that drama all about? Uh, doctor, you are my very good friend and I have never denied you anything. Sylvester, where is all this coming from? Have I ever accused you of anything? Doctor, you have never accused me of anything. So? But that girl that left here is your patient. And there is no way you will convince me that you don't know anything about that girl. I have never said that. I have never said that I don't know anything about her, okay? That guy that drove her off in her car is her boyfriend. I think her fiancé. Sylvester, why are you acting like there's something really, really wrong? Is there something you're not telling me? There is something seriously wrong, doctor. That girl rendered me useless here in Nigeria. My whole life was shattered that I lost everything the first day I met that girl and went down with her. She's fine, yeah, her cups, yeah, if you feel like say you wanna near them, one day, it's a quick go, the body in a super boob, what a bend and then the body in a wire, what a bend and then the body in a super boob. I so bad about it. The body Take a easy. Well, no, you You dare on speed, and the speed they kill. My name is uh, Sylvester, but my friends call me Sly. So, what is your name, beautiful one? My name is Naya. Naya? Yes. Are you from the northern part of this country? Oh, please take it easy, please take it easy. Oh, okay, okay. I don't like you when a man runs like that. Oh. Well, I'm an Igbo girl. Mm. Well, rooted in Igbo. My name is actually Fenanya. But because of um, how classy and, you know, amazing I am, my friend decided to name me Naya. Oh, Fenanya. Mm. That means love. Exactly. Wow. Well, I don't mind if you shower me with love by the time we get to my house. It depends on your capacity, what you're willing to do as a man. Oh, well, money is not the problem, Naya. I can't even pay you in dollars. <laughs> I like the sound of that. Come on, <laughs> let me go home and spoil you with money. I hope you talk too much, bros. If I see you bring up a time on you, will see me do my work well. Bah, they go, they go and brought the problem. There is money. <laughs> My, Don't worry. <laughs> when I see you behave like a real man that you claim to be, then watch me unfold. I will manhandle you. Uh, yes, Don't worry yourself. I'm going to yeah, I'm talk with them. Go to the Namuta, go to the Yard, it's good where money day. Okay. I pay in dollars. Okay. okay. You look so beautiful. I am beautiful, I know. Wow. <laughs> A Bobby my DM said I'm pretty. A <laughs> Bobby my DM said I'm pretty. Uh, yeah. yeah. Wow. Mm. <laughs> wow. Ah, 
Naya. Ah, wait now, wait till they happen. Why are you resisting me? You followed me to this place because you have decided to give me a chance. Mm. Why are we finally here and you are showing me this red flag? Why this attitude? I never even see anything. You they see red flag, you they cry. You go see green, white. Ah. Make you no say in you day. What do you mean I'm showing you red flag? Huh? If I must be caught with a man, it must be well defined. Yes! You brought me in here. You have not even said anything to me. You just they rush me, they rush me. I mean, I don't understand. No, 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 no. It doesn't work like that, oh. Uh, uh, Naya, who does that? Naya, why are you talking as if you are a call girl? Uh uh. If I wasn't a call girl, would I have answered you when you called? I'm a call girl and I'm so proud of it. Uh, uh. Mm -hmm. You are a call girl and you're not even hiding it. Uh, why should I hide it? Eh? I mean, that's to tell you that I do not pretend. The truth is, 99% of women out there are all call girls. Dep I mean, depending on who is calling anyways. So why should I pretend? When you saw me walking on the road, I'll be, I be your mama, I'll be, I be your sister. Why you can't carry me? Are we in any way related? No! I also want you to know that you guys that go around chasing women, spending money loosely, you know, buying drinks, spending money on women, and also doing dorime inside the club. All of you are criminals. So, <laughs> we all know ourselves. You know me and I know you full well. It is not true. Well, I haven't come here to banter words with you. Neither am I here to argue with you. You brought me here for a reason, which I know. So, if you really want that to happen, <laughs> show me the glimpse of what you can do. You, you already told me in dollars. So, show me. And when you do that, I will be able to tell you whether I could spend time with you or not. <laughs> you know what, Naya? I like you. Um, you like the language of money. Who no like her? And I'm going to speak on that language. I'm coming. <laughs> Naya. <laughs> oh. Sweet Naya. Mm. You know, I told you to calm down. Money is not the problem. Mwoka baga si go Singapore, baga Hong Kong. Tisa Singapore, Kulisia Australia. You know, here is a one thousand dollars. I believe this is more than enough to have all my tinaya do crazy things for the money man. <laughs> See this Malaysian moko, huh? You got all this money we did here. Only one thousand dollars. Now you won't give me. Uh, is everything all right? Are you okay? I'm very perfect. Everything is okay. Oh wow, that's good. That's good. Yeah, you are really speaking in the language of money, man. I love that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, I believe. I, I believe. Um, everything is okay. Oh, uh, you know. So uh, it's okay. Uh, you know, I love that. Uh, wait, 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 wait. What is it now? Ah, uh, ah. Uh, you know, there is something they call highness. Yes. <laughs> so with highness, I can do a whole lot to you. You have no idea. <laughs> but but not, not, not this way. Allow me to, you know, do some whiskey. Get me Cubana whiskey. I know. Let, let, let or if they don't have Cubana whiskey, get me live beer. Can we just have one? No, no, no. Oh, no I, I'm too high. You want me to do my work, right? Yes. Get me Cubana whiskey, okay? <laughs> The they come softly, 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 no go. Your honey pot is one in a million. Why do you allow me to sleep this long? It didn't wake me up. Oh, I'm tired. Hey, 
Naya the honey pot. That should be your name, not only Naya. You know what? Uh, let us go for one more again. Naya? Are you in the bathroom? Naya? Cannot happen to me. Somebody should wake me up from this. And what is going on? Eh? Wait. One night I shall work. All my hard-earned money. Hey! Jesus. I know nothing. And I saw Nigeria. I shall work the behavior. My car. All my hard-earned money in Malaysia. Everybody in them with them in Singapore. Hong Kong. Now let me see. Everybody want to go for one night I shall work. No, 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 I'll go and look for this girl. Now, let me see, let me see what they do. Hey! Hey! May I have the money? No! Hey! One I call the Doctor, the only thing that girl left with me was my house, myself, and my furniture. Oh, God. I am so sorry, my brother. But you did say the girl that made away with your money is Naya. The one that just left with her boyfriend is Mirabel. Are you sure you're not mistaking her for Naya? Doctor, I am sure of what I'm saying. Whatever her name may be, whether Mirabel or whatever, I can recognize her face very well. That girl is a criminal. She stole from me. I... I... For one moment, I... When you stepped in, I saw that she was looking so uncomfortable. Because she's a criminal. And when I asked her if she's okay, she said yes. I can't just imagine the length at which girls can go. Uh, uh, doctor, I'm really sorry. I don't know how this may sound to you. But you see that girl, she will return everything you stole from me. Huh. I really don't know what to say concerning this matter anymore. My sins have caught up with me. I don't think I'm going to survive this. Oh, Sylvester. With the help of Dr. Davis, would definitely come after me. But I really went too far. I drugged and left with everything that guy had labelled and toyed for day and night in Malaysia. Oh, goodness. I would have just left with the $1,000 he offered me. But my greed has finished me. In my quest to belong to the League of Big Babes, I had to do the unimaginable. I have lost my womb in the process as well. Lost my usefulness as a woman. I am just like a vegetable. Now that I've found true love, there is no more life left in me. Mirabelle. Woe is me. I am better off dead than this type of misery. I'm better off dead.
If anyone comes here looking for me, tell the person that my health deteriorated and I went back to the village to take good care of myself. Don't ever allow anybody into my compound. Have you heard me? Okay, ma. On no account should you allow anybody into this compound without my notice. Okay, ma. Not okay, ma. I know you very well. You can be funny at times. If you dare allow anybody into this compound, I will not just fire you, but I will lock you up in a room and set you ablaze. I mean every word of it. Don't play with me. I'm not joking with you. Ma, I have never disobeyed you before. You know, go start now. I've heard you. You can go. And what are you standing here doing? Sorry, ma'am. I said leave. Okay, ma'am. Sorry for yourself. I'm not going to run this story. No can open my gate for anybody. Oh. Where's your madam? Uh, uh, my madam say, make her tell you, say, she don't travel to Papa village for a What do you mean travel? She traveled without informing me? No. Oga, no vex, oh. no vex. Uh, she say, make her tell you, say, her sickness don't worse. So she don't go to her papa house to go die for there. What do you mean die? What kind of talk is that? Why would, why would she talk like that? But, sir, I don't know. Now she talk up. Now what she tell me, say, I'll tell you, now I'll tell you so. No, nothing, nothing will happen to her right now. I'm, 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 I'm sure no, she will have to find a way to help her. She has to find a way to survive it. You know, I mean, th th there is no me without Mirabel, you know. I, this is all so sudden. Okay, okay, take heart. Take heart, sir. That's what life be. But why didn't she call me? What, did, did she try calling me and she couldn't reach me? Because I, I, I don't understand why, why she traveled without, without, without calling me. Oh God, I, I don't know. I don't know. Seriously. I don't know. I think I should just... Don't you think I should travel? Not go in search of her? Ah. Oh God. That, that's what I think I should do. There is no gain saying that Johnson truly loves me. He loves me indeed. He cares a whole lot about me. He has helped me to know that what he feels for me is real. Since he can take a bullet for me, it's better I lure him into dying with me. He will have to end it once and for all. I remember the verse of the Bible that says, Vanity upon vanity, all is vanity. I am just tired. Speed, they kill. I they 
My name is uh, Sylvester. Here with me is uh, Dr. Davis. He was the one who treated your madam when she was admitted in the hospital. Please, go and go. I want to see her. Stop! Ah! What? Uh, what happened? Uh, what is it? Ah! I got a problem there! What kind of problem? What, what is it? problem now? Yeah. What is the problem this now? <laughs> My mother! Huh? Your madam what? My madam is dead! What? No, 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 she dropped poison and died. Ha! Ah! No! Doctor! 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 This is not the right place, please. Hey, hey, one! Sylvester, this is not good. At hey! No! No! This is not good. You know what? Stand up. Get up. No! Get up. The, get up. Get up. Hey! What, what am I going to do now? Doctor, she knew I was actually going to come for my money. She went and gave herself. Listen, her family members is going to pay me my money to the last couple. What, what was the name of this now? Sylvester, relax, okay? It's... Wait, wait. The... No, no, go on. Maybe she's inside now. See, Let... stop, stop. Let's just go. Let's no, go. I, I, I need to see her comes and be sure that she's dead now. Let's go. No, this guy, come on. Let's go. Let's go. Stop this. What, what am I going to do let's now? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I don't know. What is what is it? My hand in money. Let's just go. Huh? What, 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 what was the name of this now? What am I going to do now? Will my money just go like that? Huh? Doctor, you 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 need to do something. Let, let, let it. Hello. I should be asking you that. How are you? You know what? Just come to the house. But come through the rear gate. When you come, we'll talk about it. We'll talk about everything. Okay? decided to tell you everything. I am listening. I'm here. Baby. Baby. Remember that I love you. With all of my heart. When you're happy, I'm happy. When you're not happy, just like now, I'm not happy. If I tell you. Yes, baby. I want to ask you one more time. Yes, baby. Do you really love me? With every part of me. Okay. What is it? This world means nothing to me anymore. How? That's because I outwardly I might look beautiful. But deep inside of me I am completely destroyed. There's nothing left. What are you talking about, baby? <laughs> You have a good life. You think so? 
Well, in my quest to have it all, I wanted to have the most killer body. I wanted to have the best curves in the world that attracts men. I went under the knife. Naturally, God endowed me with covetous body, but I was not, I was, I was, I was not comfortable with it. I was so greedy and desperate to have everything. I wanted more. I wanted to have everything large, big. And then I submitted myself to a surgeon who took out fat from my tummy to my Botox. What? And that led me to my destruction. My womb got badly damaged. Yes. Oh my goodness. Remember that day I was bleeding that you rushed me to the hospital? That was part of it. Does it mean I've been building castles in the air all this while thinking that I have found love? But I know you love me. Honey, I know you can do anything for me, right? There is definitely no way I'm going to marry a woman without a womb. One that has damaged hers in all her attempts to enhance her body. No, certainly not me. I want to end it all. You want to want, you want to, you, you, what, what are you talking about? You want to end what? You want to end what? I want to end it all, sweetheart. And I just don't want to end it all like that. <sighs> I want to end it all with the man I love. I want to end it all with you. Oh no, hold on a second. What are you talking? Baby, come on, please. I, 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 I don't want to die. I don't want to end it all. I... What are you saying, that's, honey? Where are you not the same person that said you love me? Yes, baby, but I, I mean, I have a life. I. This you said you love me so much and you can't see any harm come to me that you won't take it, that you would kill yourself. Yes. Was that not what you said? That's what I said, Mirabel, but you've got to understand that this is all so sudden. I mean, I, I'm not prepared to die. All right, I have a family. I have, I, have, I have people who love me. I have people who depend on me for a lot of things. I have a kid sister whose life is tied to mine. I, she, she depends on me for everything. And me die would... My death would be at her peril. And, you know, you, you, you have a family. You understand what I'm saying? It would be tantamount to, to destroying a future that is looking so good for her already. And her education would, would experience a shipwreck. I, my, my mother would mourn. My, my father would be devastated. I have people who want Are you me alive. I understand all of that, but that will be sorted out. I have also decided to transfer all the money from my bank account into yours. What? Baby, money is not everything. I mean, if, if only... 60 million naira. I can transfer that into your sister's account. I believe with that amount of money, she would not have any reason to even miss you while you're gone. Honey, listen, let's do this. Yes, I'm going to transfer the money to our account, honey. Let's do this. Let's just die together as lovers. Okay? Generations unborn will read about our love. And they, it will be in their minds forever. 16 million naira, now that's a lot of money. But the truth is, I don't, I don't wish to leave this world right now. How do I get the money from her without dying? Johnson. Baby. I know you're so intelligent to see the great picture. You can see the picture of you and I. Think about Romeo and Juliet. Think about the love exhibited in the film Titanic. It could be you and I. Great filmmakers in the future would make great films with what we are about to do. Honey, please, let's just take this decision. Let's do this. I believe we'll be, we'll be much more happier in the world beyond. All the money will be given to your sister. Please. <sighs> Babe. Please. Oh, 
Okay. But you would have to transfer the money first. Immediately. I will do it now. Oh, I have your details. It's done. It's done. I told you I can do anything, anything for you. Babe. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Okay, is it yes? Yes, baby, yes, I... So, um... I mean, what next? What, what, what are we going to do now? We, we would both, we would both drink poison together. On, on Valentine's Day. And then, oh my goodness, we would die in each other's arms. Please. Okay. Thank you so much, baby. You have no idea what you have done for me. Because this is like a dream come true. Dying in the arms of the only one that means the world to you. That is what I've always wanted. I love you. I love you, baby. Uncle. My nephew who decided to forget me. Oh, uncle, I did not forget you. Uh -uh. <laughs> uncle, I did not forget you. How are you doing? Uh, well, I'm still alive. I can see. You're not doing badly. That's good. <laughs> Thank you, Uncle. Yeah? Okay. You called me earlier. You were already at the airport. And that you were coming to discuss something very urgent with me. Yes. A matter of life or death. Yes, Uncle. Um, it's indeed a matter of life or death. Oh. Um, My ancestors forbid. Uh, what could that be? Well, Uncle, you see, the, the rate at which my friends uh, are getting envious of me worries me. And personally, I think that it calls for urgent attention. I, I don't understand. Uh, I fear that they might um, want to harm me. I hear that there is a conspiracy to poison me. Why would they do that? I don't know. <laughs> Envy, you know, my success. <laughs> you understand? <laughs> you know how these things work. So, anyway, uh, uh, don't worry. Hmm? Don't worry. Um, uh, none of our family members ever die of poison. Hmm? None. If I those who perish, perish because they don't know and they don't want to know. Because Chukwu Kabiyama has given us everything that we need. Forget it. Yeah? Don't worry about that. Um, Uncle, thank you. I hear you. But, um, you know, like I said, you know, a prevention <laughs> uh, would be better than cure. I don't know if uh, there is something that I can be taking, you know, once in a while. You know, just in case these guys carry out their threats of poisoning me and I, and I eat uh, that poison, you know, something that I can stop the poison from affecting me. That is not to say that I don't believe your story, but you know. <laughs> but you know there is. Uh, there we is. have it. Oh, okay. We have everything. We are blessed with such things. Yeah? <laughs> so nothing will happen to you. Yeah? Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> None of us, nobody, nobody from this family die of poisoning. It's not possible. Thank you. Yeah? Should we not have done it the moment he accepted that we would do it? 
waiting until Valentine's Day may give him the space to change his mind. But he already accepted the money. Johnson really loves me and has made up his mind to die with me. So we can leave this world of sorrow and frustration and transform into terrestrial lovers. Where sorrows and frustrations will be unknown. I will take you to the Okuku of our family and make you drink the water of Akaliche. Yeah? This will reveal to you any food or water that is poisoned, even drinks. But even if it fails to reveal this to you and you mistakenly take any of it, it will not harm you. Yes. How, how powerful? How powerful is this water of Akali Chichi? Very powerful. Very, very powerful. Ah. So it can, it, can, it, can, it can, you know, prevent someone who has already taken the poison from dying. Is that what you're saying? Look, you children born in the township ask too many questions. <laughs> but now that your father is late, I think you should visit her more often. So that uh, you'll be exposed to our customs and traditions and of course, the spirits guarding our clowns will be acquainted with you. Yeah? Very, very important. Very important. Okay, uncle. It's, uh, it's fine. Uh, I, I haven't seen Mama Neka. She it's... went to the market. <laughs> okay. Uh, today is a key market day. Of course. <laughs> she went to sell her vegetables. But she will soon be back, I'm sure. No problem. I'm still here. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uncle, you are sure? Uh -uh. <laughs> you don't tie with what we have here. Okay. <laughs> you don't know what we have here. There's a mistake somewhere. Wait. He's here now. He's here. It's true that Luna Bell is dead and gone. Eh? My heart and money. Hey, God, 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 have, God, God have mercy on me now. What, 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 what have I done to, 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 to deserve this? Eh? Hey! The, the worst part is I don't even know a family member on how to retrieve my money. What, what, what was the meaning of this now? What am I going to do to deserve this? So, so it's true. Mirabel is dead and gone. No, 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 now. God, 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 this is not true now. God, 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 what was the meaning of this now? God, I know that I, I have sinned against you now, but you, you, you can't just reward me with this now. I have no hiding place. John Cena and I have already planned 
on leaving this world on Valentine's Day. But as it stands now, I don't think I can wait till then. Plans cancelled. We have to die as quickly as possible. For I can't face the shame of being apprehended, disgraced and executed. So now your husband is. Who say money no good? Money so good. What are you saying? I'm just managing here. Eh? This one manage. So I no be manager. You gang gang. You stand. Get <laughs> back. Hey, but Auntie Mirabe, forgive me of my curiosity. You know, when I was coming, you asked me to take the back door instead of the main gate. That's because I do not want anyone to know I'm around. Yeah. yeah, I thought as much. But you seriously need a security man. I have no need for a good man. I'm just fine. So how have you been? How about that girl? What's her name again? Doris. Doris. Ah. Doris is, is she? good. She's good. You know, Doris got married one month after he left the compound. And she just delivered a set of twins. Boys, for that matter. Wow. You mean Doris is now married? Yes, so... With twins? Ha! She's living in U.S. with her husband and the kids. Oh ha. my God. Congratulations to her. Yes, and even me too. I'll be getting married soon. I came to invite you. Luck has really smiled on all of you. It will smile on you too, Auntie. <laughs> Auntie Mira there. Here's my invitation card. I'm inviting you specially on the 18th of this month. Auntie Mirabel, are you okay? You're crying. Um, no, I'm not. Just, just um, tears of joy. I'm really happy for you, Marcy. Congratulations. Thank you, Auntie. So this is for me. Yes. See, eh, there is time and season for everything. See, yours may not come now, but definitely it will come. Okay. I believe God. Yes. Thank you. So. I honestly don't want you to go now. If you can spend more time with me, I'll, I'll be happy. I missed you. It's <laughs> a lot of things. You don't have any problem. I personally decided to come here and have quality time with you. Hmm? I've missed you. Same here. <laughs> so you will be getting married. Yes, so... <laughs> Your card is so sexy. Thank you. I like it. Thank you. Is it even okay for me to have left her? Huh? Yes, she asked me to leave, but considering the way she has been sounding and behaving, 
should I have left? Hello, baby. I am not fine. Where are you? You really have to hasten up. It's alright. Call me immediately you land, okay? Well, guess that was your man. Yes, my man. Very cute and adorable. Mm -hmm. He has been my world. I can imagine. So, very soon, both of you will be walking down the aisle. You can say that again. Yes, sir. You know, it's good to be married. <laughs> yeah, it is. Yes. You know, I have always desired to love and to be loved. The very first day I set my eyes on Charles on that fateful day, I knew I have found my husband. Really? Yes. Let's talk about it. Mm -hmm. How were you certain that he was the right man for you when you first met? Auntie Mirabel, he has everything I asked God for in a man. He's handsome, educated, and also he's committed to God. Are those your criteria of a good man? Yes, of course, because you know I never bothered about money. All I wanted was a man who is educated and focused. Like they say, one man's food is another man's poison. Yeah. Okay. Anyways, I wish you a big congratulations mm. and a happy married life in advance. Thank you. <laughs> Auntie Mirabel, I have to start going, eh? We have been talking since that I didn't even realize that I was supposed to go. Honestly, I really do appreciate your presence, honestly. But I was hoping you could just stay a little longer to at least meet my fiance. No problem. Maybe some other time. No, I don't want you. I want you to. Hold on, please. Hi, honey. Okay, please hasten up. There's someone I would really like you to meet. Okay. Talk of the devil, my man. See, he's coming. So just wait a little longer so you can just see. Okay. Yes. Please. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, just sit down. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I didn't even ask you for what you would have. We've just been discussing. It's okay. No, don't tell me it's okay. We'll okay. get something for us. <laughs> He's coming, okay? Thank Take you. Take him easy. You dare on speed, oh, and the speed in the kilo. I take him, Jaja. No day to rush, oh. Take him, so free. So free, so free, no go, no. Hey, hey. She's looking like a pizza. Her waist beating like a calypso. Looks like she's from Sosoliso. Baby, you're me so. Me so. Wanna go ta ta ta. She's fine. Fiera. Fiera. Her cups. Fiera. If you feel like say you wanna near them one day. Iji kwego, the body na super boom bap What a bem na na no bem na The body na wire oh What a bem na na no bem na The body na super boom Hey Hey sweetie Oh. Mm. <laughs> You're welcome Thank you baby Welcome uh, sir Thank you, who's your friend? Yes, my friend We live in the same compound Oh I see My neighbor Oh okay, how are you? Fine, sir. Great. I must say, you're not short of what she told me about you. <laughs> what exactly did she say to you? That 
much. You are handsome. I ah, can see that. Don't mind her. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, by the way. Thank you. And Mercy will be getting married. So she brought her IV for me. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. It's, it's, it's uh, this is good. Thank you, sir. Congrats. Thank you. Congratulations. <laughs> so, honey, I know you had a very long day. And you need to, oh, come on, just have this. You need to relax yourself, drink. Thank you. And be fine. Thank you. I really, I really had to tell her that. No, I want her to meet you because <laughs> she told me a lot about her own man, and I really wanted her to meet my man. Thank you. Yeah. It's nice to meet you. Really. Thank you, Sam. Me too. Yeah. What is it? Hey, 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 hey. What is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? Why did you talk to me? What is it? Sorry. What is it? Remember you, you, you coming, you coming with me. You know. Eh? Eh? What is she talking about? What? You did? Oh no! Come, Come on! No! 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 What did no, she no, say? No no no, no! 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 Not now. You belong to me. Hey, we need to be together forever. What is she saying? Please. What is this? And no! 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 And ah! What is she talking about? Let's let's go. Let's get out. Okay, Antimia. No, 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 you cannot do this. Antimia. Sir. Okay. Antimia. Okay. What is it? Please, 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 Baby, please, what have you done? Baby. Baby. So what was she talking about? My God. My God. My God. Sir. Sir. Huh. Sir. So what was she saying? I need you to tell me what you know. Again. Start talking, tell me what you know. You, you were here before I walked in here, so tell me what you know. Start talking. Sir, sir, honestly, I am innocent. I'm not saying you're not innocent, but tell me what happened. I don't happened. know what happened. I don't know what no, You have to give me something. What happened before I walked in here? Okay. I don't know. Come on. Sir. Yes? Today, today is actually my first time of coming here. Okay. Uh, ever since she packed out of her compound, I came here because I wanted to give her my wedding IV, which I... Yes. Yes. So, while we were talking, she told me that she's thirsty, that she wanted to take something. That was after she took your last call. So... She, come on, come on. So then, she, yeah? she, she, she went inside the kitchen and then she came out with two glasses of juice. She gave one to me and one for herself. She was drinking it while you, you came in. That was all. So she, 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 she brought us from the kitchen. Yes, sir. Not my own. She poisoned herself. What? Why would she do that? Just uh, relax, all right? Relax. <laughs> relax, relax. She once told me that she was tired of life and that she was going to, to take her own life. Okay, so, so what, what are we going to tell the police when they come here? We are, we are going to tell the police everything. Yeah. Everything, we tell them everything. I have my personal conversations with her recorded, okay? And then, just because I suspected she was going to do this, I, I have this place wired with cameras everywhere. We'll have CCTV cameras looking at us as we talk right now. And that way, you know, we walk, we're clean. You know, that way the police stays away from us. And, and then, you know, um, but I need you to stop panicking. Mm -hmm. Just calm down. 
I believe your story, I know you have nothing to do with this. Okay, she poisoned herself. It was not your fault. It was not my fault. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. I would have answered for what I don't know. It's okay. Just. Uh... Sir? Yes. He, he, he drank the same drink. Yes, I. I, I, I... I, I took the drink, but um, nothing would happen to me. Um, let's just say that as a young man, I understood the core values of my tradition and I got myself initiated into it, okay? Uh, but first things first, we we'll have to find a way to, to contact the police and then move her body. Okay, stop, 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 stop. Hold on, hold on to your invitation card. All right, it's okay, stop crying. All right, it's okay. <laughs> I purposely asked both of you to come here today, being a care market day, because it was on an care market day that she killed herself. Justin, you offended her spirit. Yes, the agreement was that both of you should die together. You're not supposed to be alive. Um, I, I, I was not part of her sins in, uh, when she was alive, you know, we had a relationship quite all right, but her money was not the reason I fell in love with her. You know, I, I saw her light and we fell in love with each other, not knowing that she had ruined her life with surgery and criminality and then when it was time for her to take her life, she wanted me to come with her. Why are you bringing logic into this now? The offer was made to you and you accepted. You gave her your account and she wired the money. Yes, uh, because at that, at that point in my life, things were tough and I wasn't thinking straight. That money is the link she has to you. And um, for us to dismantle the connection you are going to return that money how, how do I I mean I where do I take the money to the owner of course 